what's going on guys welcome back to the channel lone wolf 902 and in today's video i want to take some time and talk about this awesome product that was sent to me and i've already been using this actually and i, I gotta say i'm really enjoying it and it makes things a lot simpler uh this is from schwarzbien outdoor and i hope i'm pronouncing that properly if not my apologies um so basically what we've got here is a table so it comes in this nice little burlap type sack. Uh, it's got the branding on the front. Now, I've already got it dirty. I've been using it a lot. So let's just go ahead and get it right out of the bag. So basically what we've got here is an aluminum table. Very, very high precision. Awesome, awesome quality. It has some threads on the back with a little thread saver. We'll go ahead and pop that off. Just a little piece of silicone to protect those threads. And inside we have two little identical shot glasses. So if you are a whiskey drinker such as myself, or if you like espresso, which I've used these for before for espresso, um, they're, they're also great for condiments. So if you have French fries and you wanna fill one with ketchup and you wanna do the other with mayo, they also work very great for that. So two little glasses there. And then we have the poles in three different sections one piece has a brass point which goes into the ground and then each piece is threaded you stack them thread them to however tall you would like it to go and then i also have a, another adjustment piece and this to me this makes this table an outstanding product i'm going to show you guys what this is for in a little bit we'll put it off to the side i also got a little shoulder bag here just with some props pretty much <laughs> For today anyways like i said i'm in my backyard i'm not really doing a whole lot uh just got my coffee maker my canister canister stove and pot and cup just to kind of decorate the table to show you what kind of uses you can get out of it and why it would be an interesting product to have because to me honestly this wouldn't be something that i would ever think of purchasing just because there's surfaces all over the place but being outdoors as much as i am I've come to love this product, absolutely. I've been using it a ton. I've been using it a lot, I'll say that. I've been using it a lot, and it just makes it so much easier when you're sitting in your hammock to set up a table, put it in the, in the, in the ground with the, the pegs, or the legs, sorry. Uh, or if you're sitting on the ground in a tent or in a tarp shelter, just to have a nice flat surface that you can move around and put down and put stuff on it. You know, you can put your espresso maker on top, do whatever you gotta do. Um, makes things a lot easier and makes just makes things interesting you know so I'm gonna go ahead and set the legs up and get the table put into the ground and we'll go over uh, a few little ideas how you can use it and just kind of go over some of the details about it all right guys so going over what I've got here in the the kit as we will call it uh, I, I want to start off by saying thank you to Tommy Tommy is the guy who sent this to me he contacted me on Instagram so he sent me over to his website and said, head on over there, whatever model you like, tell me and I'll send it out to you. So he does have many models of these tables. Some are drastically different. Some are close to this. Um, I'll, I'll kind of just go over what we've got here in this particular kit. So we have the table with the awesome B logo up top. And then we got the, the name of the company right down here. And I apologize if I mispronounced that earlier. Um, and then we got weight saver holes and other key little holes to, uh, to add little pieces, which we'll get into in a little bit. This particular model came with two little shot glasses. Awesome. And they just fit right in the holes just like that. Now, if, if you're not a, a drinker, uh, I'm a whiskey drinker, so this is great for whiskey. Um, I also use it for food. Okay. So if I'm out having burger and fries or anything that I need condiments for, these are excellent for putting ketchup and mayo inside of. They work really great for that. They're also really great for espresso. They kind of fit right on here. Now I get two of these glasses out of my little espresso maker. So I'll kind of pop it on there. I'll make one and then I'll quickly swap it out like that. And then I'll place this in the table just like that. And I'll get two shots of espresso to enjoy. So works great for that as well if you're not an alcoholic beverage drinker so we got the table we got the glasses we got this adjustment um, 
well, it, it has an adjustment screw on it. We, we have this adapter, I should say. And what this does is it allows you to take a stick, and I have one already collected behind me. It, you take a natural stick from in the woods if you don't want to bring these legs. And you put the stick in the bottom and you tighten the screw down. The table threads in here. So now the only components that you really need to bring for the table are just these two pieces. If you want to add the cups, you can bring the cups. If not, you can just bring these two lightweight pieces and you've got yourself a table. So that's awesome. I love this piece. Talking about the legs, there are three sections. They are steel. Um, well, at least the, the threads on it are steel. I'm not sure if the actual pole... It sounds like they're steel and they, they are quite heavy. I mean, they're the heaviest thing in the whole kit. And that's why I love this piece. Because if you want to save some weight and simplify things grab that for sure um, but these three pieces thread together and I'll go ahead and put them together one has a brass end so it's not going to rust or corrode and these poles are painted black to cut down on the rusting and corroding as well so here we have I want to say a 24 inch section roughly and then the table goes and threads directly onto that so we could thread this in I like starting it by spinning it and then give it a good spin. Locks right on there nicely. So we've got the table, the leg. Let's go ahead and put it in the ground and let's start getting some things on it to show how I would use it. All right, guys. So here we have the table with the three sections of legs that it came with. And I'm just going to go ahead and pop it in the ground, give it a firm press down, and that's it. You got yourself a table just like that. Now, we can go ahead and take our two glasses that it comes with, pop them in there as well. Uh, let's see what else we got here. I got my espresso maker, like I mentioned earlier. What I like to do with this is hang it on the side. So you hook it in the hole and just let it hang there. And that works great. I also have with me right now my titanium pot and cup and cutlery set. So I'll go ahead and open this as well. And neat thing about this is if I were making coffee I can go ahead and take my titanium spoon and it has these slots on the sides I can go ahead and put my spoon in the slot and let's say I wanted I got a knife and a fork here so let's say I wanted a fork as well I can go ahead and take a fork and pop it in the slot there it, it's not going anywhere as you know back and forth but it's in the slot it's there and then I can go ahead and take my cup and I can put that down and I can start preparing my coffee or my drink or whatever I'm doing. Now, I also did bring out a large canister. So this is a very big canister. This is 450 grams of isoprobutane. And I also brought with me my canister stove. So I'll go ahead and set my canister stove up here so you guys can have an idea of size and how big it is. All right, so here I have an Optimus Crux canister stove and i got a large canister like i was saying 450 grams this is pretty much the biggest size you can get and it fits on there quite nicely this is how i i like to make my coffee when i'm using it i i also do use an alcohol stove i'll prop that up here and I'll, I'll get that cooking and make up my coffee or whatever i'm making but it does hold a very large canister and then i go ahead and get my pot on top of that as well and I'll fill this about three quarters full. This is a 750 mil titanium pot and it holds very, very well. So if I wanted to boil water itself, this is what I would do or make ramen noodles or whatever. This is what I would do. Additionally, if I am making my coffee and I'm using a canister stove and not a, an alcohol stove, pop that up there just like that. And I got my glasses here so I can put my cup up there. I know these, these are really small but they work really great. So I'll go ahead and put my cup up there. And like I said, I'll, I'll quickly swap them out. So I'll be making my coffee. And when this cup's full, I'll pop that in there real quick. Drop that down there in the holder, nice and simple. Drop this one down in the holder, nice and simple when they're both full. And then I can just remove my canister, um, put it down on the ground. And then I would take my coffee maker and hang it back on the hook take my spoon and I can go ahead and mix in my sugar or whatever, whatever I was doing. I mean, if I was eating, I got my fork right here and go ahead and pull the fork out. Um, now these slots that are in here, there is an additional part that you can get 
and I wish I had it because it's really cool. Um, it holds your phone so you can hang it down there and it's on an angle so your phone can actually sit on an angle your cell phone and you can watch videos or whatever you're doing listen to music if you're with friends um, great little piece and it has little fingers almost like a fork kind of shape so you can hang things on the fingers so if you had a little lanyard on your on your fork or on your spoon you can hang utensils off of that now i don't have that piece unfortunately um, I'm very happy with what I do have though. This table is excellent and I love it. So kind of give you an idea of what kind of table space we're working with. I, I do use it with my 450 mil cup and my 750 mil pot. Give you guys a, another kind of look at that. There's plenty of working space here. Put my fork and spoon up at the far end if you really wanted to. Um, it works really great. Like I said, you can hang other things. Um, I have had my, my pot with a piece of paracord hanging off of here as well. And you can actually take your, your uh, so if I go ahead and put my, my cup in here real quick. If you have a little stick, a little piece of wood, like I got right here, and you don't have anything that can hang, but you wanna hang something off the table, I simply take my paracord or my little cordage there from my, my bag and put a stick in it and you can go ahead and drop it and now you're hanging additional items off of the table you can move things around it just it works really really well and it's it's a great product i i enjoy having it for something that's so simple being a table it's really really a game changer you be sitting in your hammock and you can be cooking things it makes things really easy so with that aside i'm going to go ahead and i'll show you guys this attachment piece that uses a stick for the leg instead of the metal legs all right guys, so here I have a stick that I've collected just from behind me and I've gone ahead and sharpened one end and I've kind of flattened off the other end. Now, this end has a knuckle on it and it doesn't quite want to fit on there. So this just kind of shows you that any stick will work. Um, you just got to shave it down. So I'm going to take my knife and I'm just going to simply knock a little bit of material off of this stick, kind of get it to where it should be without removing too much. Um, it, it does have an adjustable screw in it, so you can adjust it quite a bit to get it to fit on there. And that pretty much does it right there. I feel that's a pretty good fit. So see, we're on there, and then I'll go ahead and tighten up this thumb screw to really lock in to that stick, and it's not coming off now. So we've got a nice solid connection on there. Go ahead and take all the stuff off of the table now, and we'll thread the table into here, and then we'll pop this in the ground. All right guys, so here you can see I've got the stick leg put into the stick adapter and it, it basically connects the same way that the leg does. It just, it threads right on. And here you can see the original leg, the height of that versus the height of the stick. So we're up quite a bit higher. Um, this leg does work very well. I will say that if, if you're trying to save weight, leave this home, grab that adapter for the stick because having this, I mean, there's sticks all over the place. You can have a longer stick, a shorter stick, you can adjust it, and then all you really need to bring is the table and that adapter, that's it. So, like I said, you can kind of get all your stuff on your table, you can have it up at a more comfortable level if you're in a hammock. I love using this when I'm in my hammock. I can roll out, make coffee, hang my stuff off the side, like I said, go ahead and hang it there. Uh, put my canister stove on top and do whatever I got to do. Now, obviously it's wobbling now. I'd, I'd put that stick in a lot deeper than I got it now, but just to show that it, it does work, it, it is a really nice product to have and it's lightweight. So just wanted to share that with you guys because I've already been asked where I got it from and where you guys can get it from. Basically, uh, I've had it out in an overnighter already at a waterfall and absolutely love it made all the difference on that trip. So that's the table. This is my model with the two little cups. And if you have any other questions, drop it down in the comment section and I'll be sure to answer them the best that I can. And that's pretty much all I got for you. So check you guys in the next video.